I really like directing because I love seeing things come together and I like the creative process of it. Being able to decide where someone stands or how someone moves their hand is pretty influential to a play because theater is like full of subtle and big extravagant tropes and just things that you have to do. It's really interesting to be the person who gets to decide that, but also to see what the actors choose to do. I love music because it really just allows me to experiment. Um, I love just expressing myself through arts. I think it's fun. It's new, you get away from your studying. It gives you just a medium to explore. I feel like because like personally, I'm not, I don't talk a lot. So dance is kind of a way for me to express myself. And I don't know, dance is just, they have so many range and so many styles that can, it can be sad, can be happy, feel like very safe and very free to express myself through dance. I will really say that I love acting because I think people has a limited amount of time within their lives and they can read as many books as they wanted to. But I think reading books is just like secondhand experience. But being an actor allows you to live someone else's life in just your, far, your own perspective. You can be a doctor, you can be a lawyer, you can be a beggar within just the same day. And I think that's really cool about acting. And also maybe emotions that you can't really express elsewhere. You're really safe to do it in front of a camera. You're really safe to do it on a stage. For me personally, singing is kind of like an outlet. Um, I feel like today I get very stressed out a lot in classes and stuff. And like singing just lets me kind of release all that and just kind of be myself. I prefer singing in jazz uh, just because I think I have more of kind of a muskier, heavy voice when I sing, especially when I sing alto. Um, and so just any jazz piece just kind of gets me feeling free. <laughs> I love dance because it makes me have to approach art in a very different way. Uh, and it really stretches the, the creative side of my brain because dance is so personal um, and it has so much emotion tied up into it because a choreography can be really simple and maybe like 30 seconds long, but it means so much to the choreographer or the person who's involved in it, or it could be very extravagant with props and setting. So it there's such a big range of what dance can be. I love music for a couple different reasons. Uh, one being the the sense of excitement you get when you finally do something that you've been practicing so hard on, uh, like that that sense of achievement uh, when you when you finally get that drum fill right or that guitar riff or you know that chord progression you play it right for the first time and it's just so exciting. Uh, and the the sense of community that comes with playing in an ensemble is really great. Like whether it be a full-on orchestra or just like a little rock band that you threw together with some friends. It, it can be really, I don't know, just kind of heartwarming, kind of, it's, it's fun. I grew up listening to the Chili Peppers and um, in like seventh grade. My brothers always had guitars um, hung up in their room, but I always saw them and I never really thought anything of it, but um, eventually I just decided I wanted to play guitar and as time went on, I realized that's like all I want to do in my life. It's the only thing I, I've ever really like felt a passion for. Pomfret's given me a bunch of experiences. Uh, when Mr. Lamb first approached me and he was like, hey, do you want to direct the fall play? I didn't even know that was a possibility and that's something that I didn't expect to do until college. Um, so that was a really amazing opportunity that I was able to do now and it's been an amazing experience so far. Well, one thing Pomfret has done is mainly offer me just a time and a space to play music. Um, it's offered me a class, chamber orchestra, this term. It's offered me private instruction lessons outside of class. Um, it's also given me opportunities to play outside of class um, in chapel places. There's opportunities to play in school meeting. Just a lot of different places to explore and just to put, put my music out there. So before I came to Pomfret, I only like focused on like one genre of dance 
like in one type of music. But when I came here, Miss Jolly showed me a lot of like contemporary or like jazz or like different style and different music. And I kind of like, oh, I realized that like dance can be like so much more than just this one style. And it could be a lot of style and I can do everything with like props, settings, lights, my attitude and expression and stuff. Well, I have always been a shy kid before I came to Pomfret. I didn't really like to talk with others before. Like, I, like communication was hard for me. But then Pomfret gave me a chance to get onto the stage and really demonstrate who I am as an actor, as a person. Uh, and you really just pushed me out there onto the stage. And I, I guess I catched the chance and uh, I presented myself uh, in, through different characters and different different plays. I think a lot of not big group singing, because like when I was in middle school, we had like a big chor chorus with like 30 people, and it couldn't really be that like one-on-one -on -one sort of experimentation. It was really honing in in each section, just kind of getting the part right, and rather just like everyone doing their own thing. And then also the lessons, like where I am, there aren't really many singing opportunities, so. Here I'm able to actually explore all that. Well, before I came to Pomfret, I never actually had any experience with dance. Um, I mostly just focused on music and writing, but then I came here and I was kind of forced to do dance because of the freshman immersion program, but then I immediately fell in love with it and now I do the dance company and then there's competitions like during the spring where you get to sh show off talent and I do that with Jade. So it's, Pomfret was the place where I kind of fell in love with dance and also the place where I get to improve and become a better dancer. I've never done production before and that's something that I got to do here for the first time. Um, it was my first time working in a, a studio like a, a you know acoustic, acoustically made booth and you know, working with the equipment and uh, putting together something which is my own, uh, which I can actually show to people without actually having to sit there and play it for them, uh, and and be able to compose something which is more than just what I'm capable of on my own. I don't know. People normally don't play with me at home. There'll be like one friend that has a guitar and will play with me, but nobody ever wants to play drums and. Yeah, I found so many drummers that want to play with me, so I've never really done that before. Or like once before I've done it, but um, it's fun to like consistently have people to play with and jam with. And I started singing, which I've never done before. I love. I love. I love. I love. I love. I love. I love to. Sing. Dance. Music. Playing guitar. Music. Directing. Dance. <laughs> Acting. 